so like always, I don't really have a script. I just have a subject that uh, I want to speak on. And um, I really uh, like this statement by Devin Haney. I'm not a fan of Devin Haney. Um, I have my reasons, probably because he's dick sucking lips that he has, but um, that's just one of the reasons. But anyways, no, this is just jokes by the way. Don't get butt hurt. Um, he says that he's fought, that Javante Tank Davis has fought nobody and um, that he doesn't want to fight him either and I agree with that um, but we're gonna do some investigating um, uh, to see the resume of both these fighters because Devin Haney said that um, Tank Davis hasn't really fought anybody so let's check that out but while I look this up what's the damn deal with uh, Tank Davis and uh, Floyd Mayweather um, I feel like there's something weird going on with them. Like, uh, I agree with um, Devin Haney that um, Tank doesn't want to fight anybody. Um, it's like, why are you with Floyd if he can't get you the fights that you need? You know, so he's fought Rolando Romero, Isaac Cruz. Leo Santa Cruz, Gamboa, he fought Gamboa, okay, and um, Fonseca, <clears throat> Liam Walsh, <laughs> I remember that, but um, yeah, Liam Walsh was, oh, he, uh, he also fought Jose Pedraza, right, um, so I wouldn't say his resume is that bad, I mean, I, I don't think that he's really fighting people that are at elite levels when he does fight these uh, decent names. Um, let's look at Devin Haney. Um, the Dream. What kind of name is that? The Dream. Yeah, he's, he's got those DSLs. So, um... Uh, Haney's also fought Gamboa. He's also fought. He's fought Linares. Um. Antonio Moran. Um. I don't know. I would say I like Tank's resume better than Devin Haney, but I would say that Devin Haney has better accomplishments than Tank, obviously, because he is the W. Well, not, not just the WBC, but he is the undisputed champion. Okay? Um, so, yeah. I, I, I wouldn't say that um, skill-wise, there's a huge discrepancy. I think this really boils down to the politics of the Mayweather uh, camp and the promotional company and stuff like that. It, it's like what's going on that that weird three-way that they have with broner and tank and floyd it's like some weird three-way going on and it's always some like drama but it seems like feminine to me it seems all feminine to me i don't know maybe it's just the way that i think i'm a little perverted so maybe i'm just thinking in a gay way because i'm a little perverted but, um, yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about, um, Tank and, uh, him being with Floyd. Do you think he's happy with Floyd? Do you think that he's okay with, um, you know, aging himself out? You know what I mean? Because that's pretty much what he's doing. Um, shit. I don't know, man. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. And, uh, thanks for tuning in. Bye.